Welcome back to the garage here at Basin Motorsports. I'm Kanan, and today we're going to continue on with our 3D printing. And today we're going to print out some brake duct grills off of Thingiverse. So the C5 Corvette on the Z06 at least has two brake ducts in the very front grill. And they don't actually have any protective grills on them. So out on Thingiverse, which there's a link in the description, if you want to download this file, you can download it. Somebody else has designed these and I have just pulled them in and made them good for PLA, which is what I have in the silver, and I'm gonna print out two of these. Now what you see behind me right here on the printer is printer number one. I wanted to make sure it worked before I filmed this, so I've already done one, and we're gonna take this off, clean the bed, and then we're gonna print number two. Now remember, anything you download off Thingiverse is free, but you should not be printing them commercially or selling them at a profit. You can print them for yourself, your buddies, but don't make any money off of it. Now all the files are on the printer already. I've already had the settings in there and we're just gonna let her rip. So I'm gonna set up a GoPro and this is what it kind of looks like as you print. All right, so two hours later, we are completely done with the print. It's about two hours and 10 minutes or so between everything else. Now we just need to peel this off. It has cooled sufficiently. It should come off pretty easily. A Little bit of effort, and then we're gonna take it over and put it on the Corvette. Nice, nice and cool, came right off. Here's kind of your testing piece. So this is the grill, it's a honeycomb shape and it's in silver, PLA. All right, so here's looking at the front of the car. You have the main grill opening. You have your brake duct, your turn signal, which some say, that looks like an F-150. But here's your turn signal housing, and this is just the front bumper. So your grill goes in. You'll notice that it will fit in to match, but it's oversized. So in order to do this, we're gonna stick this down into the duct. We're gonna use some needle nose pliers to pull it back and it should fit behind the bumper and the grill or the duct down in here. It should fit between the bumper and the duct. So you gotta kinda of snake it in and then fit it down in there just with a little effort. All right, so here is the finished piece. Now again, you can just use your needle nose pliers which helps grips the honeycomb shape. I tend to push it up to the out outer upper I guess you would say with the thinner piece kind of feed it up in there too far and then pull it back down as you get everything else fit in so you can see it fits in there nice and snug now again this is a silver PLA it's not really going to do very well long term but this is a test piece some have said yeah they would look great in black and they should be ABS to really have a long term durability for heat and um, rocks and everything else so these are just tests today, but I'm gonna go ahead and order some black ABS and then reprint these and replace these. So there you go, a simple solution to do that. Now I don't expect, for at least for my driving, that I'm gonna overheat my brakes, but you know, if you put them in and you find that your brakes are getting too hot, if you track your car a lot, well, you can always take them back out. Again, black ABS is probably the optimum condition for those, at least in this design. Thingiverse does have it out there. You can adjust the settings in uh, from PLA, which is what it comes in. Uh, you can do it for black ABS or just ABS in general. 
and then download it from there, load it to the printer, and hit print, and then just adjust as needed. Now, if you have any other questions on the Prussia printer that I'm using or anything else, I've done an assembly video and other pieces, so ask away. I'm not an expert. I'm very novice to this, but I'm learning as I go. So that's it for this time from Basin Motorsports. Thanks for stopping by. Happy printing if you're doing it yourself, or you just want to follow my adventure of learning. Enjoy.